She said the tickle. Hey y'all and welcome back to our channel. I know it's been a while since we've posted and um and I haven't did a vlog in in a while, you know. But um I noticed that we did hit 20,000 subscribers a couple days ago, so thank y'all to to all um, our new subscribers and, and our returning. Um, I'm honestly doing this video as a disclaimer for some of my upcoming videos. Um, for the new subscribers, um, I am Dee Dee. I have five daughters. I have Leilani, Selenia, Eliana, Cassidy, and Seven. And um, I just wanted y'all to understand going forward, I know you guys are gonna see in upcoming videos that Eliana will be completely bald. And um, I know that that's gonna like raise a lot of questions. And um, and so uh, she does have like a medical condition. It's not cancer, um, just to make like a long story short. But um, yeah, we had to we had to shave her hair, and um, or we're we're doing it today actually. Last night I um, I explained to her like you know what's going on and, and why because at first she was a bit emotional like I don't know I want my hair you know like because who wouldn't be like that she's a little girl you know and so um I explained to her and just was completely honest and transparent just at the level that a four-year-old could really grasp and understand it and she she actually handled it really well and so last night it started where I had to cut her dreads off um so that and like and kind of like detangle it a bit comb it out and brush it out so that um i guess the way that my ex-husband explained to me is like so that when she's uh getting it buzz cut it's not like it won't be like any lines on her head from like the parts from her uh from her dress and things and so um i did that the entire time she was watching a, a video that i filmed like in 2020 or 2019 back when i cut my hair really short and so i think that that's honestly helped her um cope with what's going on right now and so um i just wanted y'all to have this disclaimer so that y'all can know that like you know something like you know it just her medical condition required us to have to do this and so um i just just to answer like the questions that i know are about to come because there's always questions and so yeah she's uh she did really really well with me um when cutting her cutting her dress and things like that so she's um she really she took it like a champ and she's doing like such an amazing job and you know i just have to like keep reiterating to her and we as just a family like letting her know like you know you're beautiful your hair doesn't define who you are you know um you have a beautiful spirit a beautiful soul like you know it it, it is what it is it'll grow back um thicker fuller and all of that but right now this is just the cars that we that were dealt um she's been having this condition for a little over a year and a half i mean not a year and a half just a little over a year and um and i've done my best to try to like uh like just avoid having to like cut it to be honest because i know how it is like when i up and she's doing like an amazing job with just understanding and grasping what's going on and uh we just you know speak life into her and you know like keep her spirits lifted during this time um, i'm gonna take her take her and um her sisters down to my brother's house and he's gonna like buzz cut the rest of it if i have any rude comments or anything like that i'm gonna block you i might cut you out i ain't gonna lie but uh that's what's that's what's going on so you don't have to ask like questions over and over again or if you're a person and you see those questions like and you've seen this video you can answer them as well so that I don't have to like answer every single person one by one by one because that's a lot, you know. But yeah, that's basically it. I will see y'all in the next clip. And I did. She wanted to record um, me actually cutting her her dress. So, and I think it was because she saw my video, me cutting my hair. So she wants to have a video of her own. So um, you can see like her reaction and things like that as well. And you see how like how how great she actually really really handled it because i don't think i would have been been able to be that strong at her age i don't i don't think i don't know she's really really strong if she wants me to record her actually getting buzz cut then i can re record that as well but if she doesn't then i'm not going to record it you know i'm so pretty
Are you ready for me to cut yours? Yeah. You sure? Yeah. Okay. She's putting all of our cars down on the table, knowing there's no way that you'll be able to win this one. But she's somebody else in the making first she's just gotta stop all the faking and she'll be there but she's wondering if it's gonna feel like she's forever wondering if it's gonna feel like she's whenever she leaves her safe space she leaves her safe space wondering if it is Forever, or is there some place that will make her feel better? Make her feel better, then that's where she'll go. She's wondering if it's gonna feel like she's forever Wondering if it's gonna feel like she's whenever she leaves her safe space She leaves her safe space Wondering if it is forever Or is there some place that will make her feel better Make her feel better Then that's where she'll go
picture I could see if I just close my eyes Have the foresight to believe Time don't move backwards, it speeds To the future fearlessly Charging forward when I open my mouth Though I may not know how
to fall 